Rob Officer Arianna Preston had just finished her shift here as a police officer on the city's far south side early Saturday morning. Now cameras from her neighborhood show what police say happened before that officer even reached her own front door. Neighbors say that's Officer Ariana Preston pulling up outside her Avalon Park home after her police shift early Saturday morning. Surveillance video shared exclusively with ABC7 shows the person neighbors say is Preston turning off the lights to her personal vehicle and crossing South Blackstone Avenue to her family's home. That's when a dark car pulls up, stops, and at least one person jumps out. I heard gunshots about 1.30 in the morning and um, it I froze, basically. The car then speeds off. Outside, investigators say 24-year-old officer Ariana Preston laid in her family's front yard, shot multiple times. Looked out and I didn't see anything. I checked my phone, I didn't see anything. About a half hour later, the video shows Chicago police responding to the scene with SUVs swarming in from every direction. Officers quickly race back to their cars, speeding off in search of the suspects. Neighbors say detectives quickly collected all of this video as part of their investigation. More than 36 hours after that, investigators and SWAT teams surrounded a home Sunday night near 76th and South Bishop, bellowing commands. We have the building surrounded. Come out with your hands up. The ABC 7i team learned hours after that standoff, investigators arrested two men and two women in connection to Officer Preston's death. Tonight, investigators were back in Preston's neighborhood searching for any evidence still stuck at the scene of the officer's deadly ambush. And tonight, there are four people in police custody, but so far, none of them have still been formally charged. Tonight, the Chicago Police Department says Ariana Preston's death will be considered a death in the line of duty. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.